friends. Hi friends, my name is Alvaro and I'm going to show you how to mesh in Patran. Here we put file new and uh, we are now creating our database for doing our work. I'm going to call it video. That's right. Now we go to file import and we import our part made on Paracelid. Here is, here is mine. We click OK. As you can see, right here. Now we go to Mesh. We click on Create, then Mesh, and then Solid. We check is TED, TED Mesh and TED 10. We uncheck automatic calculation and we put value of 0.25. And in input list, we select all our piece. We click in apply. And here is our piece match. Now I'm going to click smooth shaded this is how it looks now we go to loads now total load on type element uniform we set the name of force and we go to input data we put a force of menos 2000 zero, zero. But well, no, zero zero and minus two thousand because we want to work it on C, on the C direction. We select our application region and we click on face of solid. Very important. Add, OK, and now apply. And you will see, that's right, you will see our forces working right here minus 2000 in or from face in the C direction now we'll click on displacement nodal and we're gonna make that fixed we're gonna call it right like that we go to input data translations and we're gonna put zero 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 that gonna make don't move in any direction don't move in X in Y and on C. Now we're gonna select for application region the holes that are in the left side. That's right, those holes. But we need to choose our right option. It's not solid is not geometric entity is not point is not surface so it's going to be edge let's see that's right mm. yes we add and now we look for the other hole we add it to we click OK and we're ready to click apply that's right friends we got our constraints right there now we go to properties we create 3D and solid oh no 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 first we go to isotropic create isotropic and manual input and then we're gonna make the other step on material name we're gonna put aluminium and we go to input properties 
elastic modulus is 10 E6 and position radio it's 0.3 that's right no more apply and there is it we have aluminium right there now we go to properties create 3d and solid and property set name 3d tits input properties we select our material aluminium and that's all we just put the we just select all our all our piece because we want all our piece made of aluminium we click apply and there is it our piece is made of aluminium now we go to analysis analyze enter model full run leave it like that uh, translation parameters mm, we leave it like that we go to solution tag we check linear static and apply it's okay if this happens uh, now we go to access results attach xdb result entities select results file and we have no xdv so first to generate xdv we need to go to nastran and select our bdf format of our work here is it working here is it analyzing it and we have to wait we have to wait until it's completely analyze it now we got our point xdb but we cannot click it i'm trying to click it right now but i can't because because it hasn't stopped now it's stopped and that's why it disappeared we click on apply and it's working and that's right and attach results file so it's already generated and now we go to our results we click on the formation select result cases and we select the formation translational apply and that's our result that's how our piece will deformate it with that constraints and with that loads and here is an animated example and that's right that's all friends